Trying to slim down before the binge-eating holidays arrive? From Thanksgiving to Christmas is absolutely the time when you tend to eat more than you normally would. But how do you find the right diet? I think it is confusing with so much information out there. With these diet plans, I mean, every, every month it's a different story. Good housekeeping columnist and fitness expert Jim Karras has the skinny on the latest fad diets. You can piece together different parts of many of the popular diets and customize it to you. Let's begin with the Atkins diet. It has had a big comeback because it allows dieters to eat food packed with fat and protein. By banishing carbs like pasta and ice cream, the scale goes down, at least at first. Most people have a problem with eating too many carbohydrates, so when you virtually eliminate them, you might identify a lot of the problems you're having with your eating. Kara says if you go for the plan, cut the carbs, but stick with healthy protein and a good dose of fruits and vegetables. One of the hottest diet trends hails from Miami and is called the South Beach Diet. This plan allows you to eat only lean protein, for example, from salmon or chicken breast. But like Atkins, it initially cuts out carbs. The diet claims you will drop up to 13 pounds in two weeks. Is something to use to get yourself started, but it is very restrictive in terms of what foods you are allowed to eat. With the Sugar Busters diet, you are urged to eliminate sugar and foods like white rice and potatoes, which quickly convert to sugar in the body. Most of the benefits of the Sugar Buster diet can be derived by diabetics. While fad diets may give you the push you need, Kara says long term, it's the tried and true, cutting calories with a balanced diet and exercise that will help you get slim and stay slim. I'm Edie Magnus for the Good Housekeeping Reports.